Cupid, a young bay mare, was bought by city broker Ranald Laurie in 1911 as a present for his son, Vernon, on his 15th birthday. For the next three years, the teenager spent his days hunting with his beloved horse in the countryside near the family farm in Essex. But in 1914 war was declared and Ranald, who had recently resigned his position as lieutenant colonel in the Territorial Army, enlisted, joining the 271st Brigade of the Royal Field Artillery. In that December, just two days after finishing school, Vernon was on active service as second lieutenant. Father and son began preparing the family's horses, Cupid, Flashlight, Polly and Nimrod, for battle, readying defenses on the English coast in case of a German invasion. It marked the start of a remarkable journey that lasted more than four years and saw the lorries and their horses traveling thousands of miles to serve on the front line. Together, the men and their horses faced the horrors of conflict together. They trudged through the muddy fields of France. Dragged guns across the Sinai Desert in the sweltering heat. And survived gunfire on the Gaza battlefields. Now, through a moving collection of letters sent back and forth from her owner, as well as touching photographs and candid diary entries, Cupid's incredible story has been told.